Eni me mungu ya shora Akokoto ni luko Wednesday, October 19th, 2022 Jando and Funke's visitation to all 245 wards in Lagos began this is a Limosho local government where members of the party were already waiting in a Kumoja roundabout to welcome the pair to the largest local government in Lagos. <laughs> On day one, Jando visited four out of the 11 wards in the local government. His first meeting was with the Bales, the landlord association in Anjori community, Shasha Kingdom. <laughs> Molemi o ni se campaign awon tun ma duro so kan to ti e mo ipita n gbe bawo lo seri mo ni ma mu jumi lo gbogbo world bam bam kiri nkan to sele nbe mo ti debile ni mo ti ri mo n pada bo gege bi gomino ipile ko lati wa tun adugo ise while Jando continues his consultative meetings with critical stakeholders in Adimosho, his running mate Olufun Kindele visited Yanokbaja and Orisun Barry Markets in Shasha. <laughs> As we move within a Limosha local government, a local government with the largest population, but unbelievably with the poorest road network in Lagos. Jando also had a meeting with the National Tailors Association in Shasha community in a Limosha. <laughs> A Limosho branch of the Christian Association of Nigeria and White Garments Unification Churches. Father, we thank you so much because you are good. Non Yoruba speaking community in Alimosho LGA theaters, arts, and motion pictures in Gowon Estates. On behalf of my deputy governor to be Ishama, they are there to support you because they are tired with this government. In our churches, we are promising you our 100% vote because we are tired of APC government. Escos of Akiomu Estates Residents Association and Traditional Chiefs, Abison Estates Residents Association, all in one day. Over 100,000 people who did very well to come to this house. It is day two, Thursday, 20th October. Jando and Funke returned to Alimosho. First stop was at the Mechanic Association at the Mechanic Village in Abuliodu in Idimu. Muloboni Alimosho, okay, in a country. Ah, to Baje Bay. As you go to Tofu in Lats, the way I lie. Ah, ah, Jawuru called me for Alimosho. Turin Timuri, Ushimin Kayefi. And then a traditional chiefs in Idimu. In the same space of time, his running mates, Olufun Kindele, visited the Koto market. From Isheri to Idimu and now in Egwe, these are visions of the horrible roads in the local government as Jandor meets with our Awori chiefs and indigents in our Limosho local government. We are now with members of the Saul Millers Association in Koto Zone. <laughs> Day three, and as we drive through Alimosho, all the wards have just one thing in common, and that's terrible road network. First stop was at Ward G North, where Jando quickly met with the residents' association of Abeson Estate. We then moved to Luaga Street in Ward H, Ayoboy Kaja, where Jando met with four different corporate societies. 
We are on our way to Mero Community Town Hall to meet with artisans. <laughs> As we move on to other wards in Alimosho, we continue to experience more Terruina roads within these communities. These are executives of Lagos State Plants and Building Materials Market Association in Pipeline Road, Abu. <laughs> Jandor rounded off its world tour in Ward MI in company of Lagos West Senatorial District, Honorable Shegwa Dewale, while Funke visited Katangwa 1 and 2, Super, Ikbaja, and Pleasure Markets. From Isheri to Idimu to Egbe to Ikotua Baranje Road to Igodo, all of the inner roads are dilapidated and some bear traps. Every year, residents of most parts of Lagos have to organize over bad inner city roads. Since 1999, trillions of Naira have been budgeted for roads, but no results. It is day five. Jando and Funke's visitation to more wards and communities in Badagri continues. First point of call was the River Rhine communities in Badagri. Before Jando and Funke proceeded to meet with Badagri royal fathers at the palace of Akran of Badagri. Thereafter, Jando met with the body of Christ under the ages of Christian Association of Nigeria, Badagri chapter, and rounded off the day with the traditional worshippers. While on this, his running mate Olufunke Akindele visited Ajara Market, Agbalata Market, and Fiber Market. On day two in Badagri, Janda started the day with a League of Imams in Badagri Division, followed by a meeting with people living with disabilities and the coalition of artisans in Agadem, a part of Badagri local government. As they both rounded off with their different meetings and consultations, Jando and Funke met with leaders of Fulani, Kanuri, Hausa, Indigo communities, and executives of the Joint Drivers Welfare Association of Nigeria. <laughs> And as Jandor rounds up his board tour for Sunday, 23rd October 2022, the campaign train was ambushed by sponsored political folks around Ikoga Junction area of Badagri local government. <laughs> Despite this unfortunate incident, Dr. Abdulaziz Olajide Adidjano Jandor intensified his campaign Monday, 24th October. The train moves to a joint local government, which is the local government of Dr. Abdelaziz Omajide Adedino. Monday, 24th October, Jandor met with League of Pastors in Igede Iyano, axis of a joint local government, then paid a visit to His Royal Majesty, Elekumpa of Ekumpa Kingdom, Oba Abu Kazim Kusoko. His running mate, Olufun Kindele visited Shibiri at Janda de Market in Vespa, but she was jubilantly accepted as she convincingly preached the gospel of a breath of fresh air to these traders. Another visit to His Royal Majesty, the Odu Oya Adara Loye, a lethe of the kingdom. Second day in a jaw local government, Jandor takes campaign to River Rhine communities visiting all 11 wards. We arrive in Woja, Kekere Ward H. Residents of the community and ballets are already waiting to welcome the son of the soil. <laughs> You can see this is the condition of St. Francis Catholic Church, the only school in the community. This is Irewe Kingdom, Jandor's partner and hometown, and these are residents of his community waiting to receive their son in Ward G. <laughs> Ladies and 
Jando paid a visit to the palace of the Osolu of Osolu Kingdom of Abidin Adekombi Dorosimi, Osolu of Iriwe Kingdom. <laughs> Next stop is Ido Luwele in Ward J. Ido Luwele is a community with 1,000 people and just one dilapidated three blocks of classroom, St. Mariam Anglican Primary School, with no primary health care. <laughs> I do Dr. Abdulaziz Olajide Adenino made the final stop for the day, a visit to the League of Imams in Ojo local governments. Another day in Ojo local governments, Janda takes his campaign to Iba Housing Estate as he addresses Iba Estate's Landlord Association. He walks through Iba LCDA Council Secretariat to Oba Goriola to Aratumi, all the way to Esa Ishashi to Ijaniki. A stop at Otto Awori to address Khan Executive's Otto chapter. Jando also visited the ballet of Teddy. We begin Wednesday's world tour in Amu World of Fame. In two days, Jando will also visit 11 wards in this local government. Jando engaged residents of the Fesowakbo community and the sand suppliers at the Festac Link Bridge, Amu, and then executives of Festac Town Residents Association and leadership of Automobile Association, Headdresses Association in Amu Ward of Finloko Government, a support group of women, leadership of the Vulcanizer Association. Another quick consultative meeting with the leadership of the Christian Association of Nigeria and Okada Riders. One of the things I think your government will have to look into is the psychological well-being of the people of Lagos State. This has been neglected for too long. Thereafter, Jendo visited the palace of Dialamuhu of Ujiamu. Kabiasi welcomed his son and offered some prayers. Our final stop today was just outside the palace where the League of Imams in Amu Ward of Fin were waiting to receive Dr. Abdulaziz Olaji de Adediro Jando. First day, October 27th, it is day nine. We are on our way to the River Run communities in Amu Ward of Fin. From what we could gather, one would hardly believe that Amu Ward of Fin local government with a population density of approximately 300,000 people per square kilometer still suffers neglects and worn out roads. Jandor meets with executives of the Indigo communities in Amu Ward of Fame. Videos never lie, they say, as we move toward H, I, and J. These are river line communities in Amu Ward of Fame. The state of the roads in this local government are not excusable. For a local government of over 1 million residents, the Babaji de Sonwole government has indeed performed below expectation. We are now in Ibeche Beach, Ward H. This is Ward I, also in Ibeche community. Jandor paid homage to the Ovori of Ibeche Kingdom, of Razak Alani, and had a word with the Balis. <laughs> And speaks to the people of Ibeche who could not hide their joy in seeing a governorship candidate visit them for the very first time, carrying loud welcome by the good people of Igbologun community in Ward J. In the same space of time, his running mate Olufunke Akindele takes a tour around Alakija Market, or Jaolusi in Amuwu and Ojaoba in Kirikiri. <laughs> Friday, day 10, Dr. Abdulaziz Olaj Diadejira returned to Amu Wadafi, where he met with the leadership of Indi Guamaka Progressive Traders Association. This is the League of Chairman of the 58 major Indi dominated markets in Lagos. Your Excellency, I want to sincerely, from the bottom of my heart, after your speech, I want to sincerely commend your humility. I want to tell you that. 
the Hebrews from time immemorial we have always been supporting the BDB. You, you all of us know that. And this time around is going to be an exception. Friday, and as a usual practice, Dr. Abdulaziz Olajidea Dedero Jando observed the Friday Jumat prayers at the Ansaruddin Society of Nigeria Central Mosque, Festek Branch. This is the first phase of Dr. Abdulaziz Olajidea Dedero and Funke Kidele's visitation to all 245 wards in Lagos. Papa, Mama, Brother, Sister, this Lagos must work for all of us. Everybody just Oh yes, Lagos people, papa, mama, sister, brother, auntie, plus including uncle them. Better don't land for Lagos State Gidiba. Money will be for Lagos State, then go use them for Lagos State. Well, no more papa so pay. Then no go chop Lagos State money. Nobody go pocket Lagos State. Then go take and build Lagos State, build road, build hospital, build houses. And now only one man fit do this job. He name now. Abdulaziz or Lajide Adedirong Jando. He can't carry one of Bunga person as a deputy governor. Her name is Nafunka Kindele. My people, what will they wait for? Make we vote for light, vote for change. Nobody can change where they vote before. This one not the original change. Hmm, how am I do? Pay the pay. Everybody, Everybody.